the HW329B. So this is a, uh, a little Bluetooth board. I've got a project going where I'm trying to build out a Bluetooth speaker that I'm not exactly all the way done with yet. Still got some other pieces I need to throw on there. I want to ideally put some more batteries on there. Um, each one of them, I'm going to throw one of those little 4056 chargers on. Um, and then I wanted it to make it a Bluetooth speaker. Right now I've just got the audio input going into... Uh, you know, a three and a half millimeter mono jack coming out of that PAM 8403 um, chip. That's the one with the volume on off control, which is kind of nice. I like that particular model. Um, but so <laughs> I ordered some cheap Bluetooth boards that uh, haven't come in yet. And so I had this one laying around, but this had a little bit more functionality than what I wanted for this particular project. But as I'm sitting here, who knows, maybe I will just uh, throw this on there. So this one also has, um, you know, micro SD, the ability to play uh, music files from micro SD. Also the ability to play files from um, USB. You know, you can stick that in there. And when all I really need for this, that's all going to be kind of hidden away. All I really need is, you know, a USB connection. And this has... No, all um, I really need is Bluetooth. I'm trying just to do Bluetooth. Nice Bluetooth. It also has, uh, an equalizer button that works in that mode. So let me just take a quick look at how this works. It's got a, a kind of a cool voice. Let's see. Bluetooth mode. The Bluetooth device is ready to pair. Let's turn on Bluetooth. The Bluetooth device is connected successfully. Wow, that was super fast. I don't know what it is, but something about that voice and I really so like. Let's try to play a song on here. Yeah, only super fast because I had it paired previously. And, uh,. Disregard this, that I'm fumbling around trying to get this working. I'll get it here in a second. I couldn't find where I had the music files on the Kindle. Alright, so it's playing for this thing. So it works pretty decently, pretty fast. It's got that little flashing blue LED on there that I'd like to ideally, you know, pair with something else. No, I don't want to pair it with anything like else. What I, I want to do is on. extend it so that it can be used on the outside. But these little surface mount, um, you know, components in order to get that little small LED out of there and that it's, you know, I'd wind up probably wiping out half the board when I go to solder that. So trying to prove here that, that the contacts meet and I will actually do that but in summation I think this thing was uh, pretty good and I, I might uh, you know I'm going to make a video on this Bluetooth speaker um, and as of right now unless those other boards show up in the next couple days I just want to finish this thing off so I'll probably put that one in there so hope everybody's having a, a good time and uh, have a uh, happy coronavirus lockdown alright take care sounds alright could be a good project